Now, in my eighth grade, I don't know how it was for y'all. In my eighth grade year, everyone was trying to gangbang. Like, I don't know why. I live in a good suburban town, despite the sirens that typically pass my um house two times per stream. I live in a good area. I promise, I really do. But in eighth grade, everyone was trying to smoke and gangbang. Niggas started throwing up signs. They didn't know what they meant. Everyone was trying to, you feel me? Everyone was trying to be on that, for real, for real. Four sticks of gun now, me, I wasn't trying to be on that. I've always just been who I was, for real, for real. I was never one of them niggas, because I know, hey, bro, if I ever got into some smoke, I'm five foot, I'm not doing much damage here. Honestly, I'm not. Now, I could be like on some Hawkeye shit and shoot from a distance, throw punches in front of, you feel me? Y'all know when niggas getting jump or it's a brawl, niggas throwing punches from the side back up on some Rudy Gobert shit, on some lame nigga shit, I could do that. But, yeah, I was not doing no damage for real. Um, No, I'm not five foot, but I was back then. I was five two in my eighth grade year. I tell y'all this all the time, bro. Right? So he was one of them niggas, right? Allen, you know exactly what I'm talking about. My freshman year, bro, he just, you know, he on the same shit. He hanging out with all them niggas. I don't know when y'all started smoke. The fuck? I don't know when y'all started smoking, but niggas in my town started smoking in like 8th, ninth grade, for real, for real. Niggas been smoking since middle school, just smoked out, smoked out, smoked out. But, um, right, he was all on that. Then, sophomore year, mind you, this is new, because y'all got to understand, bro, back 27, 2017, 2016, niggas was dropping the F-bomb about the gays, not fuck. They was dropping that regular Niggas was doing all type of anti-gay shit. Niggas was saying whatever. So this shit, you feel me? The world was different, bro. This nigga, all of a sudden, start painting his nails. Mind you, bro, was just trying to, he was just throwing up, I don't know, GD, whatever. He was throwing up some, I think he was claiming crib. He was claiming crib a week ago. Not even a week, bro. He was just claiming crib. Now your nails painted? Yes, Alan. And that's my nigga, like, I'm cool with, bro. But how that work? What color? Nigga, red. Red and black. I'm like, what? Alan, yes. This is what I'm trying to tell you, bro. I'm trying to tell y'all. Now, that's still my mans. But it's like, yo, this nigga going emo on me. Like, I used to tell, bro, yo, I want a good life for you. Like, you got to stop hanging around the wrong niggas. And then he hung around wronger niggas. I'm like, bro, that's not a transformation. That's stagnation. I'm so disappointed in bro. I mean, I'm sure he good now. Now, now he in his gym bro arc. He, he in his gym bro arc. The nigga real buff. He buffer than me. Y'all know I'm buff. He buffer. He a buff light skin nigga. You know, he's doing great. He a white. Oh, no. Oh, my God. I, for, I let some out. No, no. This is not what happened. Hold on. Let me listen to this. I go to private school and niggas be saying they West Side Crip and D shit and bro got jumped by actual Crips. Hold on. I got some in my hair. Hey, bro. Niggas be wildin', especially in Jersey, I promise y'all. But, I mean, niggas really do be banging, but not in, in my town. Eh, some niggas. But, like, there was bad parts of Jersey where niggas, you feel me, re niggas really is on that. I don't know why niggas play with Jersey. I don't really know. I don't know why. Jersey is one of the best states. Anyways, after the nigga was on the emo shit, right, we was all in one big friend group. He start distancing us, and he found a friend group of a bunch of white niggas, which is cool. You know, white niggas is cool. I have a white boyfriend group. You need a white boyfriend group to keep you, I don't know, to keep you sane, you know? They take me with my black friends. We go play basketball in the summer. You know, we'll go to the motherfucking studio. With my white friends, we go on walks. We go on hikes. Waterfalls. I'm not even trolling. So, <clears throat> so right? He start finding boyfriend. Who said boyfriend? My boyfriends. Wait, what? I said I have a boyfriend? When I say that? I never said that. Let's continue. Y'all ain't saying absolutely nothing right now. So, hold on, my chat fucked up. <laughs> Yo, I'm not I'm not changing subject. I really didn't say boyfriend. Y'all just lying right now. I'm not even gonna entertain y'all niggas right now. Anyways, so no white boyfriends, bro! Oh! White boy friend group, bro. Stop being fucking stupid. All right. Yo, thank you for that sub, Frosty. <coughs> so, right? He on this emo arc, he find his white boy friends. I'm like, oh, it's not looking good. All of a sudden, 
The niggas start wearing Hawaiian button ups with shorts in the winter to school. I'm like, this nigga in his frat arc. I never seen a nigga have three different arcs in three years of high school. Two. Two years of high school. How does that happen? So now, bro, a full on frat boy, he's still cool with us. I'm still cool with bro. I ain't really talked to him in a minute. But you feel me? He a full on frat boy. He go to a white uh PWI. He probably living his life. He nice and buff. Shout out, bro, for real, for real. But yo, it's crazy. Three different arcs. Nigga, I've had one arc in my life. I've just been the same light skinned dumb nigga for real. Not even dumb. I've really been yo, the same way y'all think how I'm stupid dumb, that's how my friends think I am too. I'm now a nigga like me. I know I'm not no stupid dumb nigga. I'm just a st st stupid. I mean a oh my god! Stupid smart. Smart, stupid. Y'all know what I'm talking about. How y'all think I'm a smart, stupid nigga? Like, no, I know I'm just a smart, smart nigga. You feel me? I used the wrong S. Don't dicky. So, yo. But, hey, long story short, who in here painted their nails before? That's really what I was trying to get at. I just started rambling. But y'all know I got to talk to y'all. I just like talking. Shit, if I didn't, how's, uh, how I'm supposed to stream? Nah, you is a stupid me? dumb nigga. Nah. Nah. Hold up. Well, I have a white boyfriend group. You need a white boyfriend group to keep you, I don't know, to keep you sane. Well, I, uh, I have a white boyfriend group. You need a white boyfriend group to keep you. No, y'all see niggas missing the word group. That's a key word. It's a key word. That's a key word. That's a key word. It's like, bro, it's like you're talking about Chris you Paul. You say CP3, you leave the three out. That's a key word. Then it becomes CP. Like what we talking about. That's a good analogy. Don't be stupid. The group is in there. I never said white boyfriend group. Never said white boyfriend group. Well, I have a white boyfriend group. You need a white boyfriend group to keep you, I don't know, to keep you sane. Well, I have a white boy. Need a white boyfriend group to keep you sane. How else am I supposed to say that? You need white friends to keep you. But they, they not friends. They niggas. It's so whatever, bro. I'm not even tripping at all. Hey, bro. <clears throat> Niggas was telling me there's some music that dropped. Wait, Mr. Rage, but it's alternate timeline. Let's see this.